Hello everyone, welcome to Vlogmas Day 5. It's the day we've been waiting for today, because what are we doing? Doing our Christmas decorations! Yes! What a feeling, now it's time for Christmas. And Christmas is my favorite time of year It's beginning to look like all my wishes Are coming true, that's why I cheer So yes, it's officially Christmas tree day, so excited The weekend, so we're in our comfies, we've got bathed ready and nice and just got back in our comfies really so i've just got on these like christmas pants um i really want to wear my christmas t-shirts and jumpers and things but they're all put aside for disneyland so these pants are the most festive i can do right now just waiting for rob to get home he's nipped into town to get the euros and bits and bobs for our trip and then we're going up to the attic to get the christmas tree and the decks down we're gonna put it all together and show you our lovely Christmas tree. So just as we are waiting for Rob to get back from town, I'm putting together a beige tree decorating lunch of dreams. So we've got some like popcorn chicken, fries, brie bites, and a cheese and tom pizza. Just picky bits to have like out while we're doing the tree. And then we've got some like heroes and donuts as well. What is it with Christmas and food? I swear, it's like the best. <laughs> <laughs> so You're so good. I've just served up the beige serving tray of absolute dreams. Somehow some sneaky sausage rolls made it in as well, but that looks delicious. It reminds me of like one of those eating challenges, like whoever can eat all of this will get it like all for free and I bet I could do it. We were trying to save the um, like grazing plate of beige for decorating the tree, but it was too good. So that's all gone and we're now heading upwards into the attic. Paisley's adamant she wants to go up there. She's never been up, so we'll see. It's really high, baby. Oh, jingle bell rock. Oh, jingle bell rock. Oh, jingle bell rock. Right? Yeah. Mommy, please can we go up to the attic? Yeah. Please. Rob's doing the honours. Oh, goodness. I do not like going up there because that actually, baby, is where the spiders live. Do you know that? The lights aren't up there, sweetheart. You're so brave. I don't even like going up that ladder. How cold is it out there, babe? You okay? Here it comes. We've only got a small tree, but well, this ladder's actually quite handy. It's like a conveyor belt. <laughs> I forgot about him. <laughs> We're just residing in the bathroom, which is at the base of the ladder here. But we've got everything down. How was your first attic experience? Oh, Bren's stocking. Should we take it all down? Crackers! Wow! So what's she into today? So everything is down that's the hardest bit and we've moved the unit that's usually here up to paisley's room because that's full of her things anyway and that's the only christmas tree to go yeah that's the only place really we have for the christmas tree to go so should we get it up darling these are the favorite tree decorations i like the snowflake and the butterfly they're gorgeous aren't they yeah these two are my favorite it was this was a cat coat this then it'd be really cool so the tree's up, it's actually quite small, isn't it? Yeah. What would you like to name it, darling? So I don't think we actually gave this tree a name last Holly. year. Holly, that's really beautiful. Good job. So first up, do you know what we need to do, babe? Put the lights on. Good, let's do that. So the lights are done and Paisley has kindly sorted everything out into piles with Rob's help. So I've got like um 
the pretty bauble pile, the filler bauble pile, and then like the stringy one pile. So we're organized. I'll show you some of our different decorations. So we have like the beads and these like snowball type things. And then we have the pretty white ones, pink ones, and more pretty white ones in here. Paisley's just starting off with some of the beads, aren't you, darling? Yeah. You've been so helpful. with the tree i might need to change a few bits around later you know when you're just sitting down afterwards and you look at and you think that one's not right i'm thinking that right now about this one because the way it's showing up on the camera but yeah i'll just give you a quick once over so we've gone for a star at the top rather than an angel i do prefer to have a star although that tinkerbell one on shop disney was really nice as well we've got some birds in there some little mickeys Lots of pink and white ones, swans, butterflies, and there's a rabbit here as well. Dears. Oh, here's me and Lauren. Lauren bought me this last year and it fits on my tree perfectly. It says Disney besties. Yeah, and then just like um, angel wings, another stag's head, more butterflies, big flower. Hello. Uh Hello, gorgeous. I'm Paisley. We know you're Paisley. This was your very first Disney World bauble. And guess, baby's first Christmas. And guess what? I've got slime that I mixed with because there was some orange in there and it was purple. And I mixed it all together and it made this light purple. That's and really good colour changing, babe. This putty from Ryan's egg came gold with fun gold bits in glitter I next day I got some glitter gold glitter lots then look what I put oh goodness as you can probably tell by the slime interruption Paisley got a bit bored of the Christmas tree so I got to do most of it which actually suits quite well because I'm particular with the bauble placement mummy's a bauble Mummy's not a bauble. Yes. <laughs> We've had a card already, which is lovely. I've got this um, reindeer, the pink one. I've had him up for a while. I grabbed him from Home Bargains a while We've ago. We've got our indoor Mickey wreath, which I need to pop up in just a second. But we are missing um, some buttons. So I might see if my Nan's got like three red buttons. She may well have. And then I have got some like rose gold tinsel that I may or may not put in the living room. Like I've just popped one load up on Paisley's kitchen, which does look hey. okay, actually. Don't you like it? You didn't ask me, but I would, but I would say yes if it would look beautiful, and I would say yes if it does look beautiful. Almost forgot to show you guys this reindeer, which is like a gimmicky thing. You Go on then, press it, do the honours. Hey! <laughs> His actual mouth moves, he's so funny. Don't nip you. <laughs> he's a um, motion sensor so you walk by and he goes off which is quite hilarious found some um christmas crackers up with all the decorations and we just popped them haven't we baby girl i got a notebook my mommy got a card <laughs> 
Tape measure. Tape measure. So in a minute we're going to measure you for Disneyland, aren't we? Oh. Bren's had round about enough of it all. He looks absolutely knackered. Not the yellow hat. <laughs> I got a purple hat and I look, I look like a moonhead. I got a red hat. I got a red hat. You did. So Rob's just unveiled the tape measure. Rob, <laughs> Do it again. Get it out. You can measure your... We can measure yeah. the elves, but that is about it. We won't be measuring Paisley. <laughs> I think you're a bit taller than this. It's like a yeah. foot long. <laughs> <laughs> Measure me, guys. So Paisley's just gone with her dad and we've had an Amazon order arrive not so long ago for bits for Disneyland Paris, which I thought I'd just show you real quick. I honestly don't know why I vlog in the kitchen because the lights are so strong that I just look like I don't even know what. So apologies for this big ghostly appearance, but here's the bits and bobs that I've ordered. So firstly, I got some um, like boot socks to wear to keep my ankles warm so the breeze doesn't go down between my like jeans and boots. I don't know why they're vacuum packed as though they're some sort of weird bacon, but they are. I got some cycling shorts to wear underneath my dress so my dress doesn't blow up and reveal the full moon to everyone and they're gonna keep my butt warm as well. So they're good. We've got a scarf. No, I don't know if that's the scarf I've ordered for myself or the scarf that I've ordered for Paisley. I need to open that up and have a look. I think it's my one because of the size and weight of it. It feels quite big. And then um, Paisley's also got this um, hat, scarf, glove combo which is a pink unicorn which you can't really see that well like here on the camera but he's got the ears the unicorn tusk is it a tusk or a horn it's a horn isn't it and he's mane and then it comes down like a scarf and then her little hands go in there i'll pop a picture in because i did take a picture of her in it earlier but she's been after one of these and that should keep her warm when we're away as well i think i've got a few more bits coming on monday so we'll see what arrives because I don't even remember what I've ordered at this time point. So trees up, it's nice and Christmassy and festive in here, which is quite lovely actually, isn't it, Rob? It's, it's, nice. it's really nice to have it up and the lights twinkling away. Just watching some Mr. David and Mr. Ian on YouTube um, for the evening, and we're settled in. I've got my little vino for the night. It's a Saturday, um, so wine time. Going to watch some Saturday night TV soon. Um, I'm smiling, but I'm actually quite upset deep down because I've lost, when I say I, I don't think it's me. <laughs> We've lost all of our Disney World Christmas decorations. And I say we, I mean between Harvey and I. So last year was tricky. So I moved from the family home into this home. Harvey moved out of the family home like seven months later into a temporary place because he's doing up his new house. And um, between all of that moving, the box of Disney decks is missing. Harvey's adamant, I've got it. I'm adamant, he's got it. But I've also had a message from the people that bought our last house to say, we left some stuff in the loft. So my last hope is that the Disney decks are in there because if you've seen our Disney decks before, there's probably about 10 really precious Disney World decorations from all of our trips. So if they're missing forever, my heart's broken because there are some really precious ones like the first ones that Paisley chose, some really special moments at the Disney parks and they're expensive as well. Like it would be a real shame if they're gone. So my last hope is on this lady who's in our old home producing those. I'm going to collect the stuff from her tomorrow. So fingers crossed that's what's in the box. So we'll see. I'll update you tomorrow. But yeah, that's our day. That's our evening. I really hope you've enjoyed the vlog. We had a lot of fun putting the tree up. pacey has been so cute today. I haven't actually left the house at all. Been in my festive gym jams all day, which has been nice. It's very chilly outside, it's windy and rubbish, so a good day to be indoors. That festive lunch, I call it a festive lunch, there's nothing festive about it really, but it makes it feel festive when you're putting the tree up and like the brie bites and stuff are kind of festive, I guess, but that was really good. So thank you for watching. If you have enjoyed this video, as always, please do give it a big thumbs up and subscribe for more fun. See you real soon, guys. <laughs>